today's video we take the Traxxas Max for time trials. We also see how well the Wiremax kit performs at the track. Coming up. What's up guys, I'm Joe and I'm Amber, we're the, the RC Kiwis. Kiwis. On our channel we do from bash and crawling, speed runs, unboxing reviews and much more. So if you're new here, consider subscribing, that way you won't miss out on any of our future RC adventures. Today is a great day and that's because I hit a PB on the deadlift, that's right man, 210 kgs. Kgs, I put the weight up the ground, off the ground and I put back down on the ground. I'm actually not a big deal of myself, I'm normally my best presser, but hey look, that's not why it's a great day. It's a great day because it is time trials time, and what that means is, Amber and I, we head to the track, and we take our RC, in this case the track is Max, and we just see who can get the fastest lap time. But before we head to the track, let's install the Wide Max kit. Well actually, Joe's going to install it while I go and watch Riverdale. Okay guys, so just installing the Wide Max kit. Now these are the, there are four parts you're going to want to need. So you, obviously you're going to need the Y-Max kit. We've got the green, it's 8995G. And you'll see the other model numbers there for the various different colors that it comes in. And then just 8995 for the black version. Uh, then you're going to want to definitely get the uh, metal drive shafts. And make sure there are two. There's one for the regular uh, Max and then there's also a wide. Uh, max version, so make sure you get the Y-Max version, and this is the number you're going to want to get 8996X, so make sure you get this, the Y-Max uh, Then the other two you're going to want to get are uh, these um, Which are part 8654 And then of course these which are 7758G, that's for the green So I know there are other colours for that as well, so these are the parts you're going to want to get to make your Traxxas Max, a wide max beast. The reason why we're going with the metal drive shafts, you can see uh, in that earlier clip there that the plastic one just snapped off. And being the wider kit, the drive shafts are going to be pushed out further. And I've seen in other people's uh, videos where they've kept the plastic and gone wide, they end up just breaking their drive shafts really fast. So make sure you guys go ahead and get the metal ones. And all of these upgrades here, I'll put a link in the description for you guys. Look at them, man. They look beefy. And they look long, longer anyway. Um, I'm not going to do a tutorial on the install of the Wide Max kit. There are so many videos of that on YouTube, as well as the official uh, Wide Max uh, install from Traxxas. So make sure you check those videos out if you want to know how exactly you install these parts. Extended versions of the Max's extreme duty cold weather suspension arms available. Another thing I'm changing out is the drive shaft. It's just a stock one, 8955. This one has, has been slightly bent, and so. Might as well switch it out while I'm taking all this stuff apart. Just worked out why this piece broke from the drive shaft and in, what are these, the, the knuckles or I'm not sure exactly what the, the name of these pieces are called. But anyway, I know what this is called, this is called a bearing. And this bearing in here is stuffed, it no longer spins. And so that will be the reason why this broke, probably a build up of friction and heat, eventually uh, weakening the plastic and causing it to break during a heavy landing. So there we go guys, it's important to check your bearings, that's why. So this bearing's all good. And everything else in the car, all the bearings have been good. But this is the one bearing that's not good, and this is the one part that uh, snapped. New bearings, new drive shaft, and look here, look, if you look closely at the bearing, I'm rotating the drive shaft, and what you don't want to see, is you don't want to see the entire bearing rotating with the drive shaft. See that? It's not rotating, just the inside's fine to be rotating, but see the outside's not rotating. If the outside is rotating, that means your bearing is seized up and it's time to switch them out. So make sure you go around, check your bearing from time to time. Another way is if uh, it's really hard to turn. Especially if like, you know, three of your wheels are turning really easily, one of them isn't, a bit more resistance there. That's probably because one of your bearings is stuffed. Right, the kit is all installed and they're about to catch the Black Hood in Riverdale. Comment down below, do you have the Wide Max kit and what do you think of it? I've no idea what she's on about. Anyway, it's time to head to the track, but before we do, let's check out this Traxxas Wide Max. Here we 
are at Lali Warehouse in Hong Kong, about to get our Trax Max out there for some time trials. Um, check this out, we're using these batteries here. I do not recommend these batteries at all, man. I mean, this is our third battery from this make. I'm not sure this kind of make you might know if you're in Hong Kong. We got these from RC Mart. And one of them, the cell is completely dead. The other one's puffing up like a balloon. This thing's puffing up like I am on the bulk. Don't recommend these batteries, man. But it's going to have to make do for today. We'll eventually get some new batteries. But anyway, look, man, it is nice. There's only a couple of people on the track. So we're going to get this uh, Traxxas Max out on the track and warm it up. Catch me howling at the moon Control time guys, Amber is upstairs, she's on the control, she's going first and it is two laps each, who's going to get the quickest time? Our current speed record was with the Armour Typhon 6S version 4, we got around here in 32 seconds, make sure you go check that video out after this video. Anyway, I'm going to give you the countdown, are you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one, and go. Alrighty, let's go. We have to beat Joe at something. <laughs> okay, so as you know, uh, Joe has put the wide cap on the max. However, the steering is a lot hard, a lot harder. I'm not sure why, but it does feel way more stable. It was a little bit difficult in the warm up. I'm not going to lie. I did flip a bit, and I did get stuck um, on the barriers around the track, only because. I'm not used to the steering being this, I don't know what you'd call it. There's a little bit more resistance to it. Um, but hopefully, I'm gonna try and take it a little bit slower around the corners. So then, I can win the race. Because it does spin out quite easily now. Still love this car though. Uh, I am interested to see how the Kaibu does. We haven't used it at the track yet. Alrighty. Haven't flipped yet, guys. Ooh, can't see Joe. Oh my gosh. Alrighty, we're coming to the final, <laughs> the final straight. And time. There we go. Well done, that was two good laps. Oh, I'm popping. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm poking all the bands. I need to get their cardio session. Oh, this is my cardio session. Oh, you wait till rope season. All right, all right. Get your butt downstairs. It is my turn. All right, guys, look, man. It's not raining inside. It's not raining inside because there is a roof over our heads. <laughs> this is just sweat, and I'll tell you why because I didn't run around this track two laps. I'm gonna be completely transparent with you. I ran around this track maybe a hundred times for Amber to get uh, two decent laps. So I mean, she did well. I'm happy she got two laps with no crashing. Very well done. So I mean, how do you think you went? I think I went okay. I could have done better, but the steering has changed a little bit. So I'm interested, interested to see uh, how well, you do. We're gonna find out, man. I know it might've been a wider turning because it's got that wide max kit on there. I'm no, not it sure. It felt like there was more resistance in the turn. Okay, all right, well, so I'm, about, I'll describe it. I don't I'm about to find out. So it's my turn, I'm gonna head upstairs. Amber's gonna be sweating in a second when she's running around. That's Man, okay, because I'm a little bit more fit than Joe is at the moment. You probably are. <laughs> all right, guys, I'm on the controls now. Amber's downstairs, she is the camera woman, and we're just gonna jump straight into it. All right, give me the countdown, I'm ready. Ready, are you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. 
Right, and we are off. Oh no. Now I've turned the stability control off. I, I don't know if that's going to help me out. Probably won't, but um, we're going to find out. So we've just installed the Traxxas Max Wiker for the very first time and definitely seen a huge improvement in the handling. I will say though, I feel like the turning circles are a, a lot bigger. I don't know. I might be completely wrong. We did put the heavier diff fluid in. Oh, I could try for the flip. Come on, you got to try for the flip. Maybe later. <laughs> that could have ruined my time. I could have ruined my time there. And it did have a lot of goes with it, which means the battery could be weak. Maybe that's why. Maybe that is why. But uh, <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. So it's, it's installed and it's running good. And hey, look, if you want to know how to do ins install it, just go on YouTube. There are so many videos, including uh, the official Traxxas video, which is what I use to help install it, as you saw earlier on. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, so far. So good. We're gonna have to see how it holds up when we go bashing. Yeah, this is my final lap. I need to start concentrating here um, because at the moment I think it's pretty close of time. We're gonna find out at the same time when we get home. Oh, can I get a flip this time? Can I get a flip this time? What do you reckon? Oh, just couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. Damn it. Oh uh, well, we're gonna have to. You have to stay tuned for some uh, flips when we take it out to the track. Some big proper flips. I definitely do feel like the battery is uh, getting a bit slower though since we started. That is not. An excuse, or uh, well, maybe it is. But yeah. here we go. This is this is it. This is the final stroke. I'm gonna, I'm gonna floor it. Way and there we go. And uh, we have time back there. So I'm gonna head downstairs, and we're gonna find out what my time was. All right, guys. Joe, how did you find that? Oh man, I don't know. I don't, it'd be pretty close. It's pretty close. You see, we we did those laps with the TSM completely off, but I just turned it on and had a couple of practice laps, and it actually felt better. Really? So you know, at the end of this week, or you know. Very soon, we're gonna have a race day coming with the Max and the Rear Cat. So you don't wanna miss that video. And uh, hey, look, I think we might have to put the TMS on for it, because I think it did help. TMS or TSM, I don't know. But anyway, it was a lot of fun. It'll be pretty close. Let's head home and see who got the best score, best Alrighty. time. Alrighty, and don't mind my forehead, I've been bitten. <laughs> yeah, don't mind mine, I've been out in the, in the He's rain. He's been in the shower. I've been in the rain, yeah, in the shower. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a lot of fun there. We always have so much fun at the track. Anyway, before we reveal who got the fastest lap, First of all, hey, if you enjoyed today's video, smash that like button. And if you didn't, smash it anyway. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of our future RC content. Hey, look, we've got the Kaiju, Rear Cat Kaiju. It's going to be going out in the next video for some time trials. And then we're going to have a race day where the Max goes head to head with the Kaiju. And then, of course, we've got much more content coming. We've also ordered that brand new Armour Creighton 6S uh, EXB. You know the one, it's brand, it's just, just been released, well, it's not shipping out yet, but shipping mid this month, so we'll be getting it by the end of this month, so there's a lot of reasons to subscribe. Oh well, let's hear the scores, Amber, what was your fastest lap time? 36 seconds. <laughs> 36? I don't think so, buddy, <laughs> what was it? I've written it right there. It was like 46 seconds. Amber's fastest lap time was 46 <laughs> seconds, and meanwhile, my fastest lap time was 43 seconds. That's right, guys. I got the win, but don't worry, Amber. You got a chance to redeem yourself with the time trials of the Rare Cat Kaiju. We just want to say a huge thank you to all of our viewers, especially our subscribers, the ones who like, the ones who comment, good or bad. We want you to stay safe out there on your RC adventures. And remember, we're the RC Kiwis, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace out. It's time to let go. We're not going home. This feeling. This is where the beat goes down